Uh, hello again, this is S. Scott from the uh, IG forum and uh, obviously Sheffield and a uh, bit of a mess over in this corner. I was going to come up and do a little bit of tidying up in the games room. There's a few things, games and whatnot out that I've, I've had out and not put back recently which is, uh, which is bad form when you want to keep things in uh, good condition. I thought I'd play a couple of games while I was up here and uh, one of them is just a game tucked away uh, which is uh, Rastan Saga 2. That's Rastan 2 or not but uh, it's a PC Engine game. So I'm uh, just going to set the camera up and just uh, play a little bit of that. Okay, so this was a um, game I bought for about three or four pounds. And I uh, have to move the camera a bit closer on this one because the control on the PC engine is uh, very short and uh, it's hard to, to uh, sit down and play it. So that's our intro. It's, games on the PC Engine on this screen don't look the best, but uh, the first thing you'll notice on this game is it's an absolutely massive sprite. Um, and you have your number one button jumps and your number two button slashes. So you can do up. Now, this is um, not the most intuitive controls. The, and the animation is uh, very, um, well, two frames on a lot of it. But, um, let's give it a chance. I found myself on my demo run just running a lot into the enemies. You do have a life bar. And, uh, Seems to be no matter what I do with some of the enemies, I just I just keep taking damage. So these are horrible. I seem to get them when I was just running into them. So yeah, hopefully uh, a lot of you've been out playing in the sun at least a little bit, and uh, if you had any sun, uh, we've had the kids out in the garden this afternoon for a little bit. Uh, making sure that my kids know what a football is rather than just what FIFA is. So uh, my son really isn't into games very much at the moment. He enjoys watching me play them. Well, I think he does. Not like this, he doesn't. And uh, my daughter will just play uh, more interesting sort of PS and iOS games. Which seems to be a, a lot of the generation now. Uh, we'll just go on the internet and play flash games. Or so she has a 3DS, but uh, rarely seems to. Uh, Seems to use it, I think I've used it more than her, it's got Mario Kart on it. <clears throat> okay, so this level looks a lot like the first. What am I supposed to do with this? Anything? Doesn't look like it. I'll leave it. Okay, so this is a little bit more variety on this level. I, I bought my uh, PC Engine quite a few years ago now. It was one of the first systems I bought of a friend of mine who had things like the Sharp 86000 and, and other systems. And uh, I really wanted a PC Engine, it's something I never had as a kid. And there's all these people say they, and they had one. And I'm very surprised because I knew nobody at all who had one. Okay, this looks like a bad guy, which means I'm probably going to die. I'm just going to mash at the keypad here. I don't think this is a good strategy. Oh god. Come on, come on, oh, he's gone. Got a jewel. I've opened a fire now, I'm determined to ho hold my ground at any cost. Okay, so some will certainly be dead in 30 seconds then. I've actually got used to the game a little bit in terms of the controls. Unfortunately, um, you seem to get hit so easily. That might be me just being awful at it, which it is, but... Uh, 
Oh, it's a new weapon. Oh, I'm still here. Three, four lives instead of three, it seems. I've turned it a Wolverine. There's some new bad guys there. I'm definitely not learning anything. I keep making the same mistakes every every go. Okay, I think I will uh, leave uh, Rust on the bad. So it's very similar to the um, Blades of Vengeance game that I looked at a little earlier. And uh, I guess uh, with a few repeat plays, you definitely get better than that. It's just remembering a few repeat patterns and things like that. So uh, yeah, um, if you get a PC Engine, that's uh, probably worth a look at. I've probably not sounded my most inspired watching the or playing that game. But um, um, I, to me, having played so many games as I have, I think doesn't really offer anything new but uh, still it's worth discovering these games I just paid a few pounds for it a long while ago and uh, it's always nice to discover these so um, anyway I'm going to put another video up uh, soon so uh, thank you for watching